do we teleport anyone? You know what, actually? I'm gonna teleport the freaking Jester into the next chamber. That is hilarious. Hello everyone, Time to Grind here, and today I wanted to check out Deepest Chamber, and we've checked it out previously as a demo, but it officially launched in early access, and it's a deck building roguelike, like Slay the Spire, but it's like horror themed and stuff. So I'm gonna just jump into a thing, we'll try to remember and see if we can remember the game, uh, and uh, embark type. So normal run in Victoria, salvage a card, and trinket to use during a quest run, quest... Um, okay, well, I guess salvage is like the normal thing we're gonna do, so, uh, obviously we're on Ascension level 1, and, uh, we can only go to the sewers, I guess, because it is in early access, so we're going to the sewers, it is. Choose one of the supplies, a potion or three gold. Don't really remember what these do, so I'm gonna just take the gold. Uh, win three chambers to descend below. Normal, normal. Um, so we earn some extra gold if we go there. Put away one card for the chamber's duration. Um, additional card choice, random class. I don't know what that means. I guess we'll do that last. Let, let's just do a normal one, try to remember the game here. And, uh, yeah, it's kind of cool, because it's like a whole, like, uh, you know, uh, I don't know, it looks real, and it looks spooky, so we kind of got to remember, we have our mana here, um, and, uh, let's, let's see here. So heal, uh, singular, single cards, uh, discard into the singular pile, so I guess we can only use it one time, usable for one draw. Does that mean it's can be used for a certain amount of draws per chamber? Oh, so that's what just the singular means, I guess. So per cha oh wait, per tr chamber. Oh, does that mean okay. I think that means the whole cha not like each individual thing maybe, but the whole uh thing. Oh, no, no, no. This is just the one chamber because it's a floor. I don't know. I think we do once per combat. <laughs> okay, we're taking way too long, but what is we got to remember how the game works. So He's going to deal 8 damage to us and blind draw, uh, corrupt spirit, which is reflect attack, returns the first damage to its dealer. Okay, well we're gonna defend then, I guess, we'll, we'll defend, and then we will just do a little slash attack, no big deal, that got reflected, and uh, now we're going to, uh, we probably should heal, but I'm gonna do fire mage, I'm gonna deal damage here, I guess. So he, he uh, keeps some block for the next round. Oh yeah, you get to keep it, what, for one turn? So we can just kill him, right? Yeah, five to eight, four to six, get out of here. I guess we have some quest progress. So two gold, choose a card. Uh, deal one corrupt, uh, oh no, no, just deal one of that type of damage, apply three corrupt spirit, which received healings reduced by 50%. It's free. Um, don't really remember the, um, oh, this is, this is a priest card, priest card, thief card. Oh, okay. Uh, so it's a bard song heal for three every round for four rounds That's pretty cool exhaust innate. Oh, and it has okay. Yeah, let's get that. That's a really good healing card. I think So when ch three chambers, okay, so yeah, we can use a more time per chamber uh, What is this buy information on who lurks below? I don't want to spend my money like that. I'm assuming it's just gonna help us the toy chariot allows you to teleport to the candle sanctum on each new floor the goods of traders are renewed Okay, let's wait one time. Damage reduced by 30% for extra gold. I think we could do that. Limitless strength. Increases strength every round. Oh, man. Okay, we so decrease. He's going to decrease our draw. So we just need to do straight damage. So we're going to slash. Might as well do this little healing thing. Um, I don't know. That seems to be a good play. So our draw is even lower. So we just need to do damage. Fireball. Fireball. Oh, this kind of sucks that we... uh. What's it called? We lost the damage, but I think we can just kill him now. Easy peasy. Got the five gold. We get a card. Um, gain four block. Gain four additional block if you haven't gained a block from a card during the previous round. Drawable from two? What does that mean? What does that mean? Um, uncontrollable force steal 9 to 12. That damage each usage reduces its power when drawn damage all enemies for one. And it has, oh, three uses. Okay, that's good. I like that there's a lot of like, you know, uh, what's it called? 
like kind of single use cards. So we did that, that was no problem. Um, extra potion, let's do a deposit. Put away one card for the chamber's duration. Additional, yeah, what, what does that mean? Oh, select cards to remove, heal. So for this chamber, we don't need to heal. Yeah, whatever, we don't need to heal. Um, so holy shield 12, absorb 12 damage, corrupt spirit. Uh, I don't, I don't remember what that does. Uh, increase the card cost. Um, do we want to heal? I think we just do straight damage. Let's Let's kill this lamplighter. We can get a little block here uh, Absorb something. I don't know. It's gonna try to heal lamplighter. Uh, well, no, thank you We probably could have done the slash instead, but and that got increased energy cost So we'll just slash we'll do a single thing. He's gonna heal the corpse That doesn't oh it brings it back. Oh, I forgot it brings it back. Well, uh, can we kill it? Six and uh, six. Okay, we killed it. <laughs> Get our shield out. Oh, faded. I don't know what he just did. Okay, well, five to eight. Four to six? Nope. Okay, whatever. I don't want to use that uncontrollable force until we have to. But there we go. We did it. So we probably want to kill the healers first. Makes sense. Um, for a goal, to choose a card. So... Draw two cards, cost one extra energy on every odd usage. Oh. Transform two cards in your deck for the chamber's duration. These cards are really cool. I, like, the presentation of this game is really top-notch. Like, the artwork. Uh, removes the latest buff and deals five damage of a buff. With, nah, let's just get the... Do a little thief build so we can collect a trinket. Rolling pin. When charged up, gain one energy. Incoming attacks, charge it up. Oh, so we just get one extra energy after we've been hit? It's pretty d decent. Oh, we have to take six hits. Oh, we also can use that to the Candle Sanctum. We can only use it twice. On each new floor, the goods are... I don't think we have money. If we only have two uses, let's descend. Let's descend. Um, healing is reduced by 50% on your group. Um... That makes it sound like we can get more units or something. That's pretty interesting. So we will, uh, we'll get that. I'm not intending to try to heal a lot. So this is going to reflect an attack. Um, does that mean it's going to go away or I think we need to kill this guy, right? That seems to be the play. So we're going to slick hands here. Got a fireball. Oh, it has the holy shield to begin with. Oh man, that's rough. Oh, we took some damage. Some enemies can reflect. Oh, we reflected. Oh, the un uh, the uncontrollable force. That's awesome. Okay, well, we're going to go ahead and use that for the first time here. Kill that. Get it out of here. It's going to weaken us. Whatever. I like that the block lasts at least one turn. Really, really like that. And I don't know what corrupting our spirit does. Mo oh, corrupted spirit. Healing is reduced by 50%. So that's, that's where all of my things... Oh, these are all of the things affecting me. That's cool. That's a cool way to put it. Um, corrupt spirit. That's fine. I don't need healing. Get out of here. Get out of here. Okay, four gold. Choose a card. Changes into something out of three possibility when using cards. Of three possibilities when using cards. Oh. Negates the next debuff and grants holy shield. It costs one extra energy on every odd usage. Bloodthirsty requires health loss before being able to use in a chamber. That is really good. Holy shield absorbs every kind of damage. Two strength. Okay, no, that holy devour is insane. Um, Let's do damage reduced. Gain a random debuff. After clearing this chamber, gain a random debuff. Damage reduced by 30%. Let's just do a single normal one. Let's do a single normal one here. Filth. Receive two filth cards of attack with a card. Limit. Oh, this guy's this guy's infinite scaling. So we gotta we gotta figure that out here. So we're going to honestly let's use our bard song here, and we'll do that. That's all we can really do here. Okay. They added curse cards to my deck. That's okay. We kept some of the block. Um, heal 8 to 12. I kind of want to do that. Steal our buff. Oh, that's... Negates the next debuff. Does that count? Is that a debuff? Steal a buff. I don't think that gives me a debuff. Dang, I don't know what it's going to give him. 
Um, well, we'll just do damage, I guess, on this guy. I would like to heal. What do you steal? He stole the holy shield. Oh, man. Yeah, that wasn't the play. Disable a random trinket. No, thank you. No, thank you. He's going to steal a card. We just need to do straight damage to him. Stole our heal. Um. Hmm. Yeah, this, uh. Removed from our deck. I don't know. I guess we're already. Yeah, we already used up our uncontrollable fours. Um, might as well block. I mean, as long as we block, it's fine, right? Um, fireball slash. Oh, man. I don't have the mana for that. Remember to use all of your energy. No, that would have not worked. Um, okay. Five, five, four to six. Oh, my gosh. We took a lot of damage here. It's doing a lot of real hard fights. So we got that, though. So three gold. Choose a card. Um,. Deal through damage, apply two vulnerable, suffer more damage. That's a really good card. When discard pile size is even, hasten the lastest round. Hasten. Ha ha plays out a round based buff or debuff instantly. Oh. If odd, hasten a debuff. Oh, so just okay. But I kinda want the vulnerable though. Okay, let's go to the sanctum here. What is what is this what is this doing here? Buy items in exchange for blood. Don't really want to do that. Buy items for gold. Okay. Let's figure this out. How much we got? We got 31. Um, at the start of the chamber, discard X cards and draw that many. Eh. Um, and these are all just single use. Uh, gain additional energy every time your deck gets reshuffled. When dealing even... Oh, when dealing even health damage, gain one block. Even health damage. I guess we'll get that. That's that's just a little bit of healing. Trinkets can make or break a run. Pay attention to the effects they have. Makes sense. Um, very much like Slay the Spire. Um, we got Acid. Next round, gain two additional energy. Randomize all enemy intents and draw two cards. Exhaust. Uh, deal damage equal to 25% of uh, your missing health. Another vulnerable. Deal zero to two damage. Each draw increases its damage by three. Slick, slick cards don't count as a draw. Oh. What, does it just stick in our hand or something? I don't know, let's try that. That seems really cool. Um, and we can't buy anything else. Draw three cards, gain immunity to stun, active for two rounds. I don't know, yeah. I guess that's all we will really do. Huh, okay, so we gotta do one more thing. Um, damage reduced, damage reduced. After clearing, gain a random debuff. I guess let's do this and get some extra gold. I don't know, I don't feel like we need potions, but... Okay, so they both have filth. They both have filth. Um, okay. Probably need to do the bard song. And draw two cards. We're gonna just block some of that. I think that's the play. Oh, it took the holy devour, that sucks. Um, okay. Heal for 8 to 12. Oh, you're stealing the buff. Oh my gosh. I forgot I can look at what they're going to do. Man, um... Let's just heal, I guess. I don't know. Start dealing some damage. Yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Okay, vulnerable. We'll do that. And then we just need to do a ton of damage. It's kind of... He's healing. Oh, man. Taking a lot of damage here. Um, deal even more damage. I think we wait on that. Um, do we draw? No, we need to We need to use that to block. Uh, four to six. No, let's guarantee that with the five to eight. And we will vulnerable. And we will slash. We just don't have the mana to play that slick hands. It's definitely getting more and more expensive. Oh, rolling pin. Uh, 9 to 11 damage. Yes, please. 15. Did even more. So, four. Oh, because he was vulnerable, probably. So, choose a card. Uh, heal for two every round for four rounds. Priest cards in your deck increase healing by one. Okay, maybe we do start getting some priest cards. Erode 70% of their block. I, I, yeah, let's do that. Obtain three bonus gold. So, we completed the floor. So, let's collect a trinket here. Gain an additional energy at the start of a chamber. Okay, I like that. 
Uh, red candles can be used to purchase unlocks in the collections panel. Ooh, so that's some out of game progression, I'm assuming. And we will descend. Okay. Oh, so there's an elite enemy. We get an extra trinket. A two minute timer. You know what? I'm going to do. Oh, there's a lot of two different. Uh, there's a lot of the chrono. Okay, we'll just do normal right now. Okay, Bard Song. Oh, they're gonna steal our buff. I don't know why I keep doing that. Disable Trinket, heal 10. I don't know, maybe we can kill this guy real early. I don't know. When enemies, when attack, some enemies can add curse cards. Okay, yeah. I got gotcha. you. Okay, they stole that, that's okay. So no reason to do that healing card, maybe, right? Oh, negating our buff, man. Um, draw two cards. I don't know. Let's do that and let's that I guess heal a little bit. Oh Divine Spirit. Okay, so we still have the Bard Song at least. Steal the buff. No, you don't. No, you don't. And uh, Holy Shield. Oh, this guy's Limitless Strength. We need to do something about that. Oh, yikes. Oh, he's gonna... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Six to eight. Oh man, this sucks. Okay, we gotta kill the limitless strength guy. No, we gotta kill the... This is not good. This is not good. Okay, let's kill the limitless strength guy, but then the corrupted spirit's just gonna revive him. I don't know what to do here. Uh, we're gonna heal. Oh my gosh, yeah, we gotta kill the healers first, I guess. I think we lost this. I think we're dead here. Nine to 11 damage. Um, and then what? Can we holy devour? Nah, it's over. Uh, can we kill him? Oh, okay. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Do that. Four to six. Okay. Okay. I think we can do this. We have three health. I disable random trinket. That's okay. Four to six. Um, I didn't draw anything. Didn't draw anything. Okay, channeled flame. Wow, that was close. I mean, I don't know what to do with this low of health, right? Like, force a card to stay in your hand, gain seven block, and gain shuffle back. At the end of your round, cards in your hand will be discarded into your draw pile. Gain two block at the end of your turn for four rounds. That's kind of nice. I'll actually do that. I don't know what we do here. Um... And what do we, what do we do? Salvage run, what does that mean? Oh, that just means like what we're trying to do here. Gold, okay, Sanctum, I guess let's go here. I don't know, can we, can we buy some healing or something? Select a trinket to transmute. Um, at round stock game calmness, chamber start with your turn. A new round starts when enemies finish their turn. Chambers start with my turn. So what, I get an extra turn? Draw one additional card, nail a card, reveals the actual values of interval cards. Um, I don't know what to do here. I guess we'll get that if that does what I think it does, but I don't know if it does. Remove talk, come close to sweetie. You're always a pleasure serving the Royal Guards. No luck yet. Have to keep trapping. I'll find a cure. What? Yo, can we do anything here? I mean, upon death... Oh, upon death, resurrect with 30% of your maximum health and lose 50% of your maximum health. Wait a minute. So would this kill us? Upon death, resurrect with 30% of my maximum health and lose 50% of our maximum health. Is that the play? I mean, because I think we're dead. Let's do it. Trinkets can make or break a run. It's important to... What? What? Are you kidding me? It doesn't work like that? Oh, man. I was hoping that I would be able to take it and then have it actually activate. But I guess, uh, <laughs> I guess not. Okay. Well, let's see what this, uh, collection does here. Where, where, we, oh, we go to collection unlocks, maybe? Um, so this is where it is. So what? There's all these achievements that we have to get, and I don't know what they do, but I'm assuming that's what I'm gonna buy. Unlockable, yeah, so I guess we actually just have to do the, uh, 
Was that what these were? Or these were separate? General. Okay, these are separate quests. Quest card. I don't uh, reward quest. Don't block during the first run. Has to be completed. So these seem like challenges and stuff like that, I think. I don't know. So let's let's try this again here. Let's try this again. We're gonna go salvage here. Obviously, we got the sewers again. Potion or four gold? Four gold. Gonna do that. Um, we'll go to normal. Cause maybe we were taking it too hard. I don't know. So, okay. We're, we're learning though. So citizen, um, they're gonna attack me. They're gonna block and gain strength. And they're gonna negate strength. Um, this person's going to heal. Okay, we gotta kill, gotta kill this guy first. Four block and two strength for Friar. Killing. Oh, he's got the holy shield. That's, yeah, forgot about that. Whatever. He's got four block. Uh, boop. Um, boop. Acid. What is that? Does acid go through? Unblockable damage. Okay, that sucks. Well, might as well get some shield. Um, little bit of slash damage, and now we can just focus on this guy. We had a little bit of shield from the last turn. And kill him. He's dead. Get out of here. I like I like the achievement progress. Honestly, it's giving like little dopamine things to my brain. Um, apply three warm light, healing's increased, lose one health, draw one card, and nailed when drawn. Uh, deal sick, and it's unblockable. Deal six damage. If this kills the target, loot three gold, and it's only used, uh, three times per chamber. That's not bad. Okay, we'll get that. Let's get a bunch of gold here. Let's get a bunch of gold here. Let's do the other normal one. Um, he's gonna reflect the first attack. Though I don't know if it goes away a turn. Maybe we try to let him do his thing. So he's gonna corrupt our spirit, blind draw, inject curse cards. Yeah, we're gonna just hit uh, hit this guy here. Hit this guy up and we'll actually defend to, because yeah, we need some defense here. Um, we will continue hurting on this guy. Come on, give me six. Give us four, that's okay. Does our block ever go away? Oh, you retain eight block each turn. I forgot that's how it works. I like that. Like that, because I'm sure if you've been watching my channel, you know. Oh, I didn't use the pillage. Rip. I ran out of gold I could have got. No, I like that, though. Like that. Eight. Might as well just defend. I kind of want to guarantee. We almost killed him. I kind of want to guarantee the thing, right? Pillage. Got some gold. We need to be getting as much value out of possible with that. Um, so we're doing thief. I don't know if that means we should be doing other thief cards, but reshuffle your draw pile. Next round, draw from your discard pile. Um, conjure two random cards and put them into your hand. Um, so I'm just means create and put them into your hand, into your draw pile for the chamber's duration. Uh, teleport the target to the next chamber. Does not work in boss chambers, only works on a single target. Apply two dazed. Cannot act while dazed. What? That's amazing. You put it in the next combat. I'm gonna do force or I don't know. I don't know. We gotta get teleport. That is such a unique card. Oh my gosh. Put away one card for the chamber's duration, but we get extra gold. Sounds okay with me. Um, we don't need We don't need the teleport, unfortunately. Okay, so we got a citizen and we got a this, I think we kill the citizen first. So let's go ahead and heal. And, I don't know, defend a little bit. I don't know. We, we have time, I guess. I don't know. Increase card cost. Okay, we're just gonna deal damage. Damage. Block here a little bit. Wanna kill this guy. Um, damage. Damage. I think we need to... Oh, we... What? Oh. Why did that go... Oh, he made a cost go up. I think I need to play a little bit more defensively, honestly. Five damage, there we go, and we got some gold. So then we will defend a little bit. Yeah, I think we just need to do a better job at defending, I think, is, is what happened. So five to eight, just defend twice. We can guarantee we're not taking any damage here. I think that is a pretty important, oh, oh, oh. And then we have pillage. We're getting so much gold, actually, with that card. Um, increase retaining block by one. Ooh, so we can just have more and more block. Oh, actually, Channeled Flame. I liked that. Liked that card. Collect the Trinket. Rabbit Feet reveals the actual value of interval cards. Values are refreshed on draw. Um, You know what? Let's, uh, let's go to the Sanctum. I mean, right? Like, we have a lot. So 
Um, when using cards of two or more energy, gain two block. At the end of your turn, gain block equal to your unused energy times two. I mean, what are our cards? So wait, it said... When using cards of two or more energy, gain block. Do we just try to do that? That's two energy. That's two energy. Maybe we just try going for that, right? Gain a bunch of block. Um, will devour latest buff. Needs one buff. Mm, deal 7 to 10 damage. Next round, lose all block. Um, deal 3 damage. If not used, attacks a random alive enemy. Warrior cards in hand. Increase damage by 1. Ooh, just a free damage. That's really cool. There's a lot of really interesting cards in this. Maximize a card's interval values for the chamber's duration. That's really cool. Um, I don't know. I don't think we really need the Azure Crystal. Um, but I'm going to take it. Remove all debuffs and apply three immobilized and invulnerable, which means I cannot act and I cannot be harmed when the effect fades. Huh. <laughs> Select a trinket to transmute. Is there anything I don't want? I don't know. The rabbit feet. Rabbit feet's probably actually really useful. Okay, let, let's just buy the Azor crystal. Oh, we completed a Margaret quest. When unlocked, a new quest card will be available. Find Margaret's cat somewhere in the sewers. Has to be completed in a single run. Oh, okay then. Okay then. Um, so is there any card above two that I actually want to purchase? That's the question. There's not really anything else I can purchase. So anything with blood? Uh, stone skin. Slick. I like free cards. Um, unskippable choices are now skippable. Consume all your gold and turn 30% of it into healing. And turn 30% of it into healing. I'm gonna actually buy that. Just in case. Just in case we need it. That's a really good, uh... Kind of potential there. So, we can now descend. Um, let's do... An elite enemy. I think we can do it, right? Unholy Link. Gain 150% of the healing that the enemy receives. And siphon if damage steals the latest buff. Oh, man. So we need to kill that guy. Um, do we teleport anyone? You know what, actually? I'm going to teleport the freaking Jester into the next chamber. That is hilarious. So now it's just, I mean, yeah, it makes this elite fight a lot uh, better. So we're going to fireball and we'll do one defend. Okay, 10 block for himself. That's okay. We're going to do that. I'm going to heal myself up here, which means we got a little bit of block. We got two block. Um, what is his block thing at? I don't know. Do they lose block? Um, so 12 damage. We're going to block. Do that. Do eight damage here. Yeah, I don't know if we could have done this. Okay, this, this channeled flame is going to... Um, do a lot of damage here for us. Now we can just do full damage. Gain some block for next turn. 12. I think we do a fireball. Probably a defend. And we'll just use a pillage, honestly. It does a little bit more damage. It's not like we can use it more than once. Um, or, you know, you know what I mean. Fireball. Definitely holding on to the channeled flame. Until it is perfect. So this is, this is a pretty predictable rotation. That I definitely think we come out of, obviously. Okay. And now here we go. Here's the channeled flame. So just deal 13 damage. And uh, that was an expensive card, so we got some block. Just going to keep doing damage. Um, definitely want to keep the pillage this time for realsies. So we're going to just slowly take this down. Does he lose shield? I don't think they lose block unless they, like, have a specific amount. Oh, Channel Flame just keeps coming back. I like that. I like that. Um, 12. You know what? I'm just gonna block a ton. He didn't lose any. Um, 7 damage. We'll do 7, 6. Okay. Just gonna block. Yeah, I'm glad, glad the Jester's not here that we don't have to deal with. Um, can we kill him? That'd be five, five, and six. That'd be 16, right? We cannot do that here. So, oh, wait, wait, we got eight, five, which would be 13. 
19. He's got 22. So we're going to take it a little bit slow still. Take it a little bit slow. I want to get the pillage, though. I will continue this fight until I guarantee that pillage. Um, six damage. Now we're going to just block so we don't take any damage. There's our... Oh, oh, oh. Four. There we go. Got the pillage. Got the pillage. Get the gold. Okay, so now we get a trinket. Uh, when a trinket is acquired, heal for four? That is not it. Okay, well, it helped me heal me four there, too, as well. Um, deal seven damage to all enemies. Gain three block, max 12. Uh, cards, gain three block. Cards in your hand. Oh, increase block by one. You know what, let's do that because it's two, and that would give us even more block with our Azure Crystal. Um, two minute timer. You know what, we could do a two minute timer. We could do this. Oh no, the extra guy's here. Oh geez, okay. Okay, here we go. We got to uh, teleport the uh, Jester. Uh, I don't have the time here. Okay, okay, it's a little, uh, okay, limitless strength. Um, oh man, I'm throwing here. I'm throwing here. Oh, it took that thing. That sucks. Okay, we gotta just full full damage here. I can't I can't uh, think. Uh, gain eight block, sure, whatever. Six. We got some gold off the guy. Okay, I think we're fine. We're gonna heal. We're gonna block a little bit. We got 90 seconds left to kill this guy. Um, gain a bunch of block. Clock is ticking. I know. Thank you for uh, thank you for reminding me here. Um, eight damage. There we go, seven damage. Pillage, nice, okay. That is a little stressful though, but uh, it's cool. Um, deal seven damage, two times overkill damage will be dealt to all enemies. Oh, okay. Um, hmm. Um, I'm gonna take Holy Devour, I think. And let's just do a additional warrior card choice. Gain a random debuff. Let's just do a normal because there is the extra guy added. I need to think I keep teleporting that guy. Okay, gotta kill the, the healer first. Gotta kill the healer. That's just gotta happen here. Um, okay, we're gonna do this. Um, that's gonna get us a lot of block here. Oh, that just keeps getting more and more powerful. That's interesting. Okay, kill that guy. Easy peasy. Um, and limitless strength guy is the guy we want to focus on. He's disabling our trinket. Disable the tooth. That is fine with me. Um, damage. And I guess we will just heal here. Corrupt spirit makes us heal less, whatever. Um, fire, or let's block. Cause that just gives us the extra block because of the Azura Crystal. Um, channeled Flame. I want to kill this guy, but I also want as much money as I can. So we're going to just do six. Oh, he reflected it. Oh, get out of here. That's no fair. Oh, man. I'm taking so much damage that I didn't need to take. Whatever. We got the pillage. Um, six to ten. We'll do that. Man. Six to ten. Okay. We can do that. It gives us a lot of block. Don't need to use Holy Devour and waste it. We only really need to use that in specific scenarios. Eight damage. Six damage. Six damage. We have, we're getting so much gold from that card. That's insane, right? Uh, shuffle three scales into our hands, which uh, gives us block. Um, choose one of your less than three energies cards still in play. Put it into your hand. Um, it will cost one energy for three rounds. Hmm. I don't know. I guess we get metal scales. I don't really know. Trinket. Gain additional energy every time your deck gets reshuffled. Collect some candles. And we will descend here. Okay. Um, you know what? Screw it. We'll do an elite battle. And then we'll teleport one of the guys. Here we go. That's, that's what we're going to do here. Um, so nullify one card. While a nullified buff is active, the next card played will be negated. Okay, we're gonna just con- Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, watch this. Metal scales. And then I conjure this, so I got 13 block. Um, which- Oh man, that's like all my mana. Whatever. Cause I do 14, only some of that goes away. Whatever. Uh, we will just teleport that guy out of here. Oh, what? 
Oh no, the negate! Oh, was that exhaust? Oh, that was exhaust too. Okay, well we get to deal with him now. Um, we're gonna uh, fireball and, oh, we don't have enough energy. Okay. Yikes, reflect for gut glutton. That's fine. Um, 12 damage, yikes. Okay, we might as well just uh, kill that guy. Get a little bit of block here, we're only gonna take two. That's okay, that's fine, we're okay. We will metal scales and then conjure chains, get all of this block here. 12 damage, we still have seven left over. Um, channeled flame, uh, fireball. Okay, like once you get down to a certain point, I feel like it is relatively, like once you get like a specific rotation down, you know? I'll just try to get as much damage as I can. 12 damage, Conjure Chains, pretty solid card. I'm just gonna do damage here. I probably could guarantee, I probably shouldn't be taking any damage. Um, we're going to Holy Devour. That seems to be like a pretty solid idea. Um, might as well get some shield up in here as well. I'm gonna just be very protected. Uh, so he's gonna nullify one, we're gonna just middle, oh, did he nullify? Oh, no, we had the effect on us. That's awesome, okay. Deal some damage, deal some damage. Gain some extra block. Um, here we go. I mean, I'm getting so much gold, 51 gold. Choose a card. Gain two block at the end of your turn for four rounds. Anything above two? Your next card will be able to target all enemies? I like that. Collect a trinket at round start, gain calmness. Okay. Um, uh, your remains, what does that mean? I'm gonna do that just to see what your remain is. So we only have two turns. Um, okay, here we go. Uh, we gotta kill this guy here. Um, we're going to heal. It's my turn. I'll take a lot of damage. Really just have to kind of go into it. Uh, your next card will be able to, uh, we'll, we'll do that, um, actually no, yeah, we'll do that, and fireball, fireball them all, that's pretty solid, I think, pretty followed, took the teleport, I wasn't planning on using it anyways, well, metal scales, conjure chains, a lot of block here, and, uh, very close to killing him, we're taking a lot of damage, um, that I am now seeing, uh, so we will do this, deal 10 damage to everyone. And, oh, that's it. Oh, we're taking a lot of damage here, yikes. Okay. Well, uh, when unlocked bug cranks can, bug cranks can appear. Oh, we just unlocked like a new enemy or something? Uh, we'll kill that guy. Reflect for corpse, don't know what that means. Don't know how you reflect for a corpse. Oh, like he <laughs> is doing it now. That's hilarious. Okay, conjure chains. I kind of want to get the um, the kill on this guy with the awesome card. We'll do a f this tiny fireball. Just, uh, Holy devour, sure. Metal scales. We still have 44 more seconds. I'm so. Oh, why am I? Oh, I had acid on me. Oh yikes! See, like, what do we? How do we heal? One unlocked bright chambers can appear. Five gold. A card. Oh. Um. Hmm. I, I guess the heal, right? I don't know what that means. Choose a trinket. Uh, when dealing even health damage, gain one block. Oh wait, our remains. Is that from the last combat? That's interesting. When dealing even health, gain one block. I don't know. I guess we do that. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. We have the block art, black art potion. Consume all of our gold and we'll heal that much. Um, Let's do a sanctum thing. Just see if there's anything we want. Gain 20% of the healing that your enemy receives. That would be really, really good. Um, Deal three damage to all enemies. Heal for the health. Uh, damage dealt, so that would be doing nine. Drawable from turn, does that mean drawable from turn three? That'd be really good, but then I'm gonna heal even less, right? Okay, I'm gonna buy that, that's an insane, that's an insane card. Um, 
So what, what would 30%, does it tell me what it would be right now? 30%, that's about like 20, 30 health or something. Let's do a normal combat here. We might be okay. Okay. Um, lullaby. I don't know what lullaby does. Lullaby heals for a small amount every round. Limitless strength. Um, so we're taking four, seven, f eight damage right now. Um, well that sucks. Am I just dead? I mean, I, do I have to use the thing now? We'll be able to target all- I mean, I block, right? So that's- I have seven. If he gets maximum, he gets it, but I don't know- I don't know how else to, uh, you know, kind of stop that, so we're gonna just, uh, fireball... Twice, I guess. I don't know. Don't get seven. Okay. Uh, four to six, exhaust a card, that's okay. Um, heal for nine, heal for eleven. Uh, we will heal for 11, and then we will, um, de do the next debuff. Actually, um, metal scales, I guess. Yikes, this is, this is scary. This is scary. Select a card to exhaust for the chamber's duration. Uh, single heal, whatever. Okay, here's the one that heals us a lot. Uh, reflect for self. We're going to, oh man, I want to do both of these. Um, this would do seven... Let's, let's block, and then Siphon Life. Stole our buff or something? I don't know. Okay, we're okay though, disable the Trinket, which was the, that uh, sucks. Um, there we go, pillage that guy. Get out of here. Oh, should have done this though. Um, I don't know, yeah, we'll do that. And six to 10 damage, we need to, oh, we reflected it, oh man. <laughs> Forgot he had Reflect, and that guy came back. Um, metal Scales, I guess we just, yeah, block up right now. That's that's okay. Uh, we gotta get rid of something, get rid of Teleport, we're not gonna use that. Um, four to eight damage. One, two, okay, we're gonna do this. And then we're going to deal six damage to everybody, and Kill that guy again. Oh man, nine damage, reflect for self. Deal nine damage. What would that nine? Fifteen. Okay, we could we could uh we could kill her. Her strength's going up, don't care. Oh excuse me? Excuse me? Are you kidding me? Okay, well we gotta use the potion here. Used up our gold, so we're not dead. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Um, I mean, I guess we do that. Do the... Why are you... Undying can only be killed by... We're dead. We're dead because I didn't read. Oh my gosh, we're dead because I didn't read. Well, I mean, this is, uh, this has been really, I mean, interesting, honestly. So, are there any unlocks now? Oh, we have to... Unlocked Margaret quest. We've unlocked it, but now we can pay the bug crank or the blight chamber. What do we want here? Um, I kind of want to see this one's more. Ex oh, we'll do the cheaper one first one So what is that blight chamber? What is the blight chamber I have no clue what that means unlocks? Well, we unlocked it though um, And that's not a trinket is it what is that embark? That's not one of these things, is it? No, it's not. Okay, well, we'll have to see. But um, overall, this is Deepest Chamber in Early Access. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was a uh, ton of fun to check this out, game, uh, this game out again. Um, definitely let me know if you want to see me cover Deepest Chamber more. You know, leave a like, all of that good stuff. Uh, if you want to see more, and make sure you guys subscribe, ring that bell, like all the big boy YouTubers say, to be notified if more Deepest Chamber videos comes out, or just awesome other roguelike content. I've got a lot of deck builders like Poker Quest on the channel right now, so a lot of good stuff. Uh, but if you guys are going to be grinding out some Deepest Chamber on your own, then I wish you guys luck, and see you all next time.